So, just the other day, I did a poll asking you guys, what game should I play next? Because I've been lacking with a little bit of motivation recently and needed some help. The poll was between Session and Skitter XL, and then I put a little section for any other games that you guys want to comment. And you guys went crazy in the comments with game suggestions, which I really enjoyed looking through. But out of Session and Skitter XL, there's a very clear winner with 77% of you voting for Session and only 14% voting Skitter XL. And that's out of over a thousand votes. So it's obvious you guys want to see more Session content. So we're going to be playing Session in today's video but quickly going through all the suggestions that you guys commented on that poll there's some crazy stuff from other skateboarding games all the way to racing games to shooters and even hello kitty adventure which i might have to play hello kitty adventure i'm not gonna lie but if you guys want to see me play other genres of games outside the realm of skateboarding that is why i have a second channel which is pigeon thief 2 which you can go ahead and subscribe to now if you wish i already have a far cry 5 video that i recorded and edited a while ago that i've been thinking of dropping on that channel if you guys want to see that let me know and I'll drop it. It's a pretty fun video. And yeah, I play a lot of different games outside Skate Sim. So if you want to see some content, then be sure to subscribe to Pigeon Thief 2 and I'll be happy to bring that kind of content to you guys there. But other than that, expect some different skateboarding and kind of urban sports content here on the main channel. But without further ado, let's just get back into some session. Alright, so we're back on the schoolyard map because I feel like despite the last video being almost half an hour long, I feel like there's still a lot that we never skated or some stuff that we can skate more on this map. And we're also here at night time because session maps always look great at night because the lighting is just so good. Hopefully we'll get some steezy tricks and maybe record some steezy clips as well. Now let's warm up a little bit here because my, uh, my thumbs need loosened up a little bit after a long day at work. And this is such a great spot to just warm up on because you can just do line after line. And you've got everything you need. You've got stair sets, you've got a ledge. I did not mean to do a double there. You've got handrails. That was a sick front three. I am still really enjoying playing this map and uh, I know that's partly due to the fact that it is the, the most recent map, but it's still pretty new. But I still think it is the best DLC map that we've got so far. Fakey front side flip. Nice. And if you guys are wondering why my kickflips might look a little bit different in today's video, they might be looking a little bit steezier. There's actually a mod that is pretty new that just dropped on the illusory discord there's a link in the description to this to get the mod called the bone kickflip mod and basically just makes your character flick their front foot out a little bit more than they normally do so it's just kickflips right now and they have one for goofy as well if you actually play this game in goofy so yeah basically your character just really flicks that front foot out a little bit more and it's a bit more boned as you can see so it just makes the kickflips a little bit more steezy and it's cool to see an animation overhaul of to some degree even though it's quite minor it's really nice to see a mod that can make the animations a little bit better hopefully Hopefully that means we'll get some better animation mods in the future for this game. But I highly recommend picking up this kickflip mod if you want your kickflips to look a little bit steezier like these do. I really like this spot here because it's quite hard to hit, but it's like a ledge to a grass gap pretty much. So you hit that short ass ledge and then you got to pop over this gap, which is pretty cool. A little back tail and then a kickflip out over the grass gap. My flip speed is kind of high, which is making it harder to catch, but uh, it's easier to flip in and out of grinds when your flip speed's a little bit higher. But I keep doing double flips accidentally. It's so annoying. Damn, that was pretty steezy. Whew, all right, let's film that one. Dude, are you kidding me? Okay, I guess we're not filming that one. This keeps happening to me recently. I don't know why, but Session has been crashing. Skitter XL has been crashing as well. This is the life of PC gaming, especially when you mod those games. And I mod pretty much every game I have. <laughs> is it just me or this camera angle like further back? Okay, something's going on with Session today. I think it's haunted or something. Like, I don't know. Anyway, we're just going to stick with this and we're going to try and land this again. Nice, okay, we got that a little bit quicker this time. Let's see if we can actually change the fisheye with the game crashing. Okay, good. Now, there is a spot just here that I got a couple tricks on in the first video that I want to get a couple more tricks on. And it's a little hidden spot, and it's just this tiny little ledge. Spots that maybe aren't even necessarily made to be skidded. Just a part of the environment that can be skidded, so I will skid it. I want to get like an only try into 50-50 or something. 
Like that, but that was pretty sketchy. Nice, that was pretty good. Probably just like a little regular tray, 50-50. Oh, yeah. I just love little spots like this. Little kickflip, 50-50. And then you have this nice long ledge here. Sick. Now, another spot that I feel like we didn't skate too much was this rail over here, which I definitely could get a few more tricks on. So let's see if we can get anything good on this. Just to start off with a kickflip 50-50. Whoa, barely held that. Let's just hit El Toro while we're here. All right, let's try to get a 50-50 to lip slide. So kickflip. 50-50 to lip slide. That was really bad. We can definitely get a better version of that. Perfect. I wouldn't mind hitting this spot right here. That's gonna look so sick in a clip. So let's start off with maybe like a frontside flip into the bank. Nice. Uh, hard, like a little hard flip. Ooh, all right. Uh, nolly flip maybe. Ooh, that was kind of nice. Oh, okay. Okay. Bro, what happened with that kickflip? Like, what if I, like... Oh, sick. Yeah, that's pretty much what I wanted to do. Damn, all right. Little inward... You can't really see it from that angle, but I got a little inward heel. Nice. That looked so good. I'm really happy with how that clip turned out. Nice. And then, uh, yeah, we'll hit El Toro while we're at it. Switch tray. That was a switch varial. I'll take it. And now that brings me to another spot that we didn't hit at all in, in my last video, which was this nice little stair set ledge thing going on here. Let's get a couple nice ledge tricks in this. Nice. Ooh, that was nice. I just noticed as well, you could skip the spot like this. So pop up here and then hit that bench, which is a pretty nice way to skip this as well. Nice. Oh, that was good too. Let's get something on this curved ledge. Oh, that was nice. Okay, okay. Nice, we got it. Try and get a couple tricks on this. Big, tall hubba. Back tail. How about a little no slide crook? Ooh. Now, what I like about this is that you can actually slide the top of the bank. There's just enough of an angle that you can actually lock into a grind. Which is just pretty sick. Even, like, this little grass gap at the end of this, too. Which is actually pretty nice. It's just cool to look at different ways to skating the same obstacle. I'll take that. It's pretty nice. Let's get a couple tricks in this little uh, day one song setup here. And we could definitely make this look a little bit nicer with uh, throwing this out. Ooh, steezy. Nice back tail. Nice, that looks sick.
try and board slide this whole rail. Sick. Inward heel, front lip. Nice. Backside flip, switch smith. I can't really think of what else you would call that. I don't know if that has a different name, but yeah, backside flip, switch smith. All right, now I think our time here is coming to an end, but I do want to end today's video off on a banger. And I think we're going to do it on this nice big double set right here. I think we can probably get a nice gap to reel trick. We need a lot of speed for this. Okay, not that much speed. That's too much speed. Yeah, we definitely got to put down the push force a little bit so that we don't go overboard on this thing. Nice. All right, we got the perfect speed now. Nice little nolly front lip. Oh, man. Okay, I was going for a kickflip 50-50. Ended up doing a double flip 50-50, which is actually kind of insane. So, I'll just take it. I hope it like a tray flip over crook. Oh, first try. There's no way. I don't know if you would call that an over crook or if that's more of a nose grind. We're not super over it. Uh, I'll leave that up to you guys to decide. But um, we got to record that one. That was sick. Okay, we're going to change the time of day a little bit because it just gets a little bit too dark around the tray flip. And I want you to be able to see the tray flip. So we're going to change it to daytime just for this clip so we can actually see the trick. Now that turned out sick, and I think that's a great trick to end this video on. Thank you very much for watching. I appreciate every single one of you. I'm going to get back to uploading more frequently. I'm sorry for leaving you guys hanging for so long between videos this time. I'm going to take in all your guys' suggestions from the poll and what games to play. Uh, so definitely expect to see some new skateboarding-related or action sport-related games on the channel. And if you want other video game content, then be sure to subscribe to my Pigeon Thief 2 channel. I think it'll be fun to start working on some different kind of content for you guys. But thank you very much for watching. And as always, guys, I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.